Hey, this is Russ. You know, the last two Russ is Right videos talked about bike batteries and battery fires and everything and seems to have sparked an interest. Yeah, see how I use that word? <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's an interesting topic because it's on everyone's minds at this point because it's a recent fires that happened on e-bikes and, you know, news articles and reports about it. So we know now, too, that the hotels are not allowing us to bring our bikes into the room. They don't want you to charge your batteries in the room. Keep it out of the room is what they want to want to do, right? I'm not happy with that, but I understand why they want to do that. They're trying to keep the hotel safe. They don't want you burning it down, right? And I made a comment on the last one, too. I said, well, how would they know if I snuck a battery in and and uh, charged it up? How would they even know that? They're not going to check every single room. And so then people said, hey, Russ, that's not ethical. That's not the moral thing to do. I didn't say I was going to do it. <laughs> I just said, what if I could do it, right? And I know that people are thinking this too. So I made the comment, all right? So am I going to do it? <laughs> no, I'm not going to do it. No, they're probably going to make you sign something saying that you, you are not going to do something like that with your bikes. So no, I'm not going to do it. But it becomes a problem for me now, right? Because how do I deal with charging the bike batteries? I can't just leave it out in their unsecured area to charge because someone just steal the batteries. Those batteries are not cheap either. They're five to seven hundred dollars or, or more, all right? Plus the charger. So here's what I'm thinking. All right, I'm gonna put this as an open call to all manufacturers to be the first to come out with this product. Okay, I'm gonna give them a product they can build for people to buy. I should do this myself and make a ton of money. They need to have a box, some type of box that's secured, that's lockable, okay? Not cheap lock, good lock, all right? That'll hold at least two batteries in there. Now, batteries come in different sizes. You know, there's the typical Halong batteries, which is, you know, your, your, your standard e-bike battery that used to be from the old days. The old days would be a couple years ago. <laughs> Or even some of these integrated batteries that come off the bikes, you know, these are like 20 amp hour batteries. They're large, okay? It's got to be large enough to hold those batteries and also smaller batteries. Maybe they can make different size battery box options, okay? So it's got to be lockable, all right? Not a cheap lock, something not that they can pick real easy or, or drill out, something that's a decent lock. And then it should hold two batteries and two chargers with an exit hole so that you can pull the, 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 the cable out and plug it into the wall to charge, okay? Now the box itself should also have some way to lock the box to a, a bike rack. Now I'm not, not talking about the bike rack on your bike, I'm talking about the rack that, like if you went to a store and they have a bicycle rack that you can put your bike next to and lock your bike to the rack. Something that we could lock the boxes to that rack okay now they don't have to supply us with the chain or the or the bike you know lock we can buy those ourselves but we need a box that you know that that has the security feature that we can actually put our locks and chains big enough for big chains to go through so that we can lock that box that way you can charge your batteries in those places and not fear that uh, your box and battery will be stolen okay this is a product category for manufacturers now that they can make, all right? And I want credit for it <laughs> because I'm coming up with this concept. I think that uh, people would buy this. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to send this uh, concept to a couple of companies and see if they're willing to look at making something like this because I think this is something that people would buy, you know? I mean, even if it cost me, even if it cost me $89 to buy a box like this, I would buy it. Because how else would I secure my batteries when I'm traveling, right? So now, here's my, my question to you guys to do. Think about how you would build one yourself. And then put a comment below and tell me how you would do it. I think if enough people thought it through, we can come up with a concept of how to build a box like this thing if it's not commercially available yet. And if you're manufacturing watching this video, manufacturer, build it fast before we build it. <laughs> All right, so then we can just buy it and don't have to build it ourselves, okay? So yeah, I think I'll send it off to a couple of uh, companies that I'm familiar with and see what they think of this idea. I mean, they, they, they have metal work, right? They, they build bikes. Maybe they can either do it themselves or find a company to do it for them and they can market it. So anyways, put your comments about this and do it soon because I got to build something fast because we'll eventually be going out on this trip. Um, the Door County trip, I think we're, we're going to do it sometime in May. So we've got a couple months, but um, yeah, i got to build it, right? So 
come up with your concepts of how to do it. We'll pick the best one and maybe I'll build one <laughs> if they don't already build one before us. Anyways, if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button, hit the share button on this one. Let's get this video out there. Let's see what other people think about it too. And the more you share it um, or, or like it or comment on it, it pushes it out from YouTube. Uh, I think this is an important one. I don't, I'm surprised it's not even available yet. They should be making these, these boxes already because uh, eventually these hotels are all going to do this. They're, they're all going to stop us from bringing things in when we're traveling. So we have to have a way to secure those batteries when they charge. Anyways, if you like this video, do that. Hit the like button, hit the share button, hit the subscribe button. I'll talk to you guys next time.